a day in my life uh, today. I'll just be doing um, wild lifting. On this block, um, there's a pino. So, like, yeah, first and second. So, basically, what I um, want to aim for is just to protect the shoots to come out from the um, wires and just to protect them from the wind and yeah so there's a second there to hold it let's stay <coughs> It's clipped as well. Yeah, like that. That's good. You do not want to have them too high as well, because otherwise, um, it won't have um, a place for them to to hold the the shoots. Otherwise, we'll be falling out, and when the can, uh, winds comes, and we're just gonna. Um, fallen to the ground, yeah. So, this no good. basically here, yeah, the right ones, clicking them right there, as you can see there. Yeah, there. So, making sure also when you're doing this, you kind of have to want to go look back because otherwise, it will just gonna get crossed up. <laughs> Yeah, but there, but there, so it kind of holds them as well. This is the first wire lifting, and you do not want to cross the wires. <coughs> Looks good, so it's kind of like holding it up. Make sure you um, scoop them as well, like it's like this. So you want them to have them inside the wires, not outside the wires. So like this one here needs to be go inside. But yeah, when you um, put it inside the wires, you have to be very careful. Yeah, because these, yeah, you're gonna damage them. You're gonna break them, and yeah, man, they just don't like that when you uh, break them. <laughs> so making sure everything's all tucked in properly looks tidy and neat as well okay so this one here I need to I need to unhook it <coughs> one there one there one there yeah so this one here need to be tucked on the side yeah like that just like that I don't know why they got two of these, but uh, yeah, I'll just use this one here. So this one here. Yeah, so it's kind of like um, follow the plants. What I mean by following the plants, because even though they got really high, some of the shoots, but you want to protect also the little one as well. So those ones, the important one as well. Because sometimes yeah, if you're only um, protecting the the big shoots, the long ones, the small one when they grow, yeah, that's not point as well. So you kind of want to follow the plants or the, the growth of the shoots. So like yeah, there and making sure you make that clicking noise as well. This one here. Yeah. 
So you can see there, it looks tidy and neat. And this clip as well. Got it there, there, there. So here, there. Placing it up. <coughs> yeah. I think I already uh, unhook it from the bottom there. The first bay. Yeah. See, this is before. I'll show you guys later what it looks like after. Yeah, see, it just looks so much better. I'll zoom it right up, eh? See, those ones already been um, wild lifted. And the ones over here hasn't. Yeah, see, that was all coming out. Yeah, you need to get that inside the wires. Yeah. Go back again, do some more. The next bay. But when you do this as well, uh, making sure you do the bottom one first and then you do the top one. The reason why, because if you straight away do the top ones, uh, yeah, that one's broken, so I'm just following. Um, the reason why I have to do the bottom one first so you can scoop it and then you do the top wires like this this one here bottom first and then the top one so, but yeah top there I don't know what happened here I need to unhook these up and then So here, bottom one first, following the plants or the growth of the shoots. So like here, so need to be well maintained as well. So here, bottom one. The bottom one. Yep. Yeah, much better. Next bay. Yeah, making sure everything's all tucked in. So a lot of things like this. Sometimes when the thing is this thing here is rotten, just go do the next one up. So it's kind of like getting everything all tucked in. Yeah, I don't have my uh, circuits here. Yeah. Yeah. Look way much better now. Making sure there's no crossing as well. The bottom wires there. It's on here. So everything all tucked in. Yeah. Thanks for watching there guys.